All right, so I don't know what type of timing 2K is on, honestly. Honestly, if we're being honest, I don't know what type of timing they're on. It's looking weird to me. They didn't drop new Invincible players. Got it. But they do have some new Invincible agendas that just dropped for today. Let's go check it out. Let's check it all out just off top. USA 5. USA 5 is here. Okay, the agendas are... We're getting to the agendas in a hot second. In a hot second, because I want to reiterate, there aren't any new players to these agendas. I mean, and I can't make this up. I mean, I I can't make it up. We j oh no, not the player market, not the player market. We hop into the pack market. You can get this Yao Ming for seventy five k VC, one unsellable dark matter Yao Ming player guard. I mean, is Yao Ming Yao Ming Yao Ming? But what we're what we're looking at is okay. Today they just dropped this at eight. They just dropped this at eight o'clock. This morning. So these players aren't new. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section, but I just got Lamar Odom out of a pack. I know Carl Malone's been here. Jordan. Yeah. Yeah. De DeAndre Jordan's been here, right? Ray Allen's been here. Am I wrong? You can let me know if I'm wrong in the comment section, but you can get your equal chance pack. You can get your equal chance pack by uh going through it. Okay. Oh no. I also wanted to point out by completing the agendas, I also wanted to point out you can still get these invincible, invincible uh cards. You can get these deluxe invincible in this invincible option pack, 80k VC, 50k VC. You see, respectfully, um, but I don't see an option to buy any invincible cards anymore on this market. I don't. I see this. I see the summits. I do see this. This uh, Yao Ming. Boom, bang, bow. Wait, let me reset. Let me reset my Xbox. I might be wrong. I haven't reset my Xbox since the update. So let's see. Sometimes that does change things. So let's see. Sometimes it's just as simple as resetting the console and getting, you know, getting the update that you need or just resetting the game. Dashboard out the game. Go to the dashboard. Come back into the game. Who knows? I don't I can't tell you at this point. But what I can tell you is that this is looking fishy to me. This is looking fishy to me. Because they haven't given us any new content this Tuesday. I was expecting more content as far as maybe some new Invincible cards. Maybe they've given us every player card that they can give us from, you know, from Team USA. I I guess we've seen all of the Team USA players that have ever lived or something. I don't know. Maybe they've given us all of the, I don't know. Somebody do that research. Somebody see if we've gotten all of the team usa players in existence in real life i mean if we i'm it wouldn't be too far-fetched to believe that they've already served us every team usa player in existence i'm i wouldn't be surprised you still can get 10 percent off up until september 8th that's still the news that's still t but today they've dropped these invincibles that have already been here i'm sure that chris paul's already been here if you want information and you want to stay up to date with the latest NBA 2K news yourself. You can scan right here. You can scan that code right there. Pause the video. Scan that if you need to. Um, I just want to keep you in the loop as far as what's going on building up to 2K25. Because I know some of y'all are still playing. I'm still having fun playing NBA 2K24, my team especially. Um, I tried to play a little bit of rec, but I didn't see any rec. Do we have no locker code today? No locker code today. Locker code season is over um, the one locker code that will carry over we see is this invincible player pack. And I believe that this carries over until you can get that locker code up until August the 2nd. So you got time, a few more days left to get that my team invincible player pack. The other two locker codes that I had previously given y'all, they're they're kaput. They're kaput. And I didn't get anything out of this locker code. Honestly, what I got out of this locker code. <laughs> I actually got a footer. I got a footer out of here. Um, yeah, Patrick Ewan. I got a seven foot Patrick Ewan. I don't like his jumper. I'm not gonna hold you. I don't like it. I just don't. I can't uh I can't lie to you. Let's get into let's get into uh what these agendas talking about though. These agendas are things are are these agendas sweet? Let's see. USA five. So we gotta make 10 three pointers in a game with a shooting guard five times. Okay, okay. Get three triple doubles over multiple games. Win two multiplayer games in a row. 
get 27 rebounds with a Clipper player or over multiple multiplayer games. Score 51 points with a Bucks player over multiple multiplayer games and then get 21 assists with a Pelicans player in a game. Doesn't seem too hard. Doesn't seem doesn't seem like that's going to be too hard to do. I mean, just to be just being honest, if we're being honest. So we have no new cards to review, but that is the T on what you got to do to get your uh, agendas done in order to get an equal chance invincible player. Get an equal chance at an invincible player. There's one card in that pack. You, you know what I mean? You might as well. You might as well get that done. And those seem easy. Honestly, those seem easy. If you run that back, those don't seem too bad. The hardest one out of this drop, probably none of these seem hard. Pause. None of these seem too difficult to uh to get done. Score 51 points with a Bucks player over multiple multiplayer games. I mean, that's not going to be hard to do. Get 21 assists with a Pelicans player in a game. That's in in a game. I I mean, you can get that done real easy. I'm honestly, you can get that done easy. You you go to the right game mode. Do the right challenge. You got that done. Do the right thing. You're good. You know what I'm saying? Three triple doubles over multiple games. That's gonna be nothing. Make 10 three pointers in a game with a shoot. If you need me to next year, maybe I'll start breaking these down on how easy they are to do and how I would get them done. Because I mean, if I'm getting three triple doubles over multiple games, I'm just going straight to a single player. Honestly, I'm going to single player. I'm going to challenges. I'll pick one of these skill challenges with maybe one of these has a triple double involved. I think uh, I know one of these has a triple double involved. I know one of these has a triple double. Um, I'm just going straight over here to which one of these has a triple double involved and I'm getting that done. Maybe these Luca ones have it. Wait a minute. No, 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 no. Back out of here. Goat series. One of these has a triple double. I guarantee you. If I need to get three triple doubles. Record a triple double with any player and the game is over. So you go in here and get your triple double, the game's over. Easy, easy call. Which one is this? Vic Victor Wembanyama. So, I mean, you go over to the challenges, GOAT series, Victor Wembanyama's GOAT challenges, a triple double. You do that three times, you got that triple double out the way. I mean, it's just that easy. You just got to use a little bit of, use a little bit of investigative uh, mindset to just investigate what you have to do and how to get it done. I mean, sometimes it just can, I can make it easier by telling you this stuff off top, but I want you to use your brain. Use your head for more than a hat rack, son. Um, I mean, no, I mean, I could help y'all out with that though. 27 rebounds with a Clippers player over multiple multiplayer games. That's going to be easy too. These are going to be easy to do. I mean, I wouldn't have you done the previous ones. If you haven't done the previous ones, I mean, they're still here too. I still got these here because I just haven't done them. But if you look up, you can get seven rebounds in a game with a Spurs player seven times. Get eight steals with a Suns player over multiple games. Score 53 points with a Knicks player over multiple multiplayer games. Get 19 rebounds with a Timberwolves player over multiple multiplayer games. Win a game using 13 Raptor players and then make nine three-pointers and shoot 90% from three-point or better with a Heat player. I mean, sometimes those could be a little bit tedious, but they're not hard to do. When it comes down to making nine three-pointers in a game and shooting 90%, I mean, that that does seem like it would be hard to do. That seems like it would be hard to do. But once again, I will come right over here to triple threat. I mean, I'll come over here to single player challenges, do these skill challenges. I would find one of these where I, how many, how, how many points is, how many points does nine three-pointers add up to? That's like, that's what, 27 points? Um, Honestly, one of these is, Easy. Michael Jordan's, I think you got to score 38 points in a game with Michael Jordan. That's close to 27. So as soon as you score 38 points with the player, you're done. So why not just go splash threes until you get to 38 points? Well, until you get to 27 points and then maybe score 37 points with another player if you're not sure you're going to keep your percentage over 90. Because 90% is kind of high. I'm not going to lie to you. 90% is not that easy to, to obtain. So Anyway, either way it goes, either way it goes, this might be the lowest amount of points to score in a game to get out of the game. But I know that the shooting is so easy in those games. If you come up with an easier way to do this, you let me know, because honestly, some people like to come over here and just go straight to the basketball fundamentals. I like to do the post scoring one because you hit enough post scores. But the, the, the thing I'm thinking about is the quarter length is only four minutes. 
sometimes I like to go in some of these harder challenges. I like to go into a a system where I have to get through like a 12 minute quarter. 12 minute quarters is enough time. It leaves you enough time with an objective that's low enough for you to hit. You just got to match your objective up. There's enough of these here for you to have free, free launch. You got a free launch at whatever you need to do between these two go series challenges. Um, I like the Go Series. I, I hope they bring back some signature series challenges next year, though. That's really what I'm looking for, as, as well as a, a few more spotlight challenges, a whole lot more spotlight challenges. We need those. I'm doing these today. I might make a video out of these season spotlights. I've been waiting to do these, but that's that. I mean, I got you with that. So let's get into whatever's next. Y'all go ahead, like the video. Make sure you subscribe because I need that. I need y'all to do that. I just, I need you to do that. So if you find any kind of value in this content, hit me up. Subscribe to your boy. We here with you. Your booze mean nothing. I've seen what makes you cheer.